Holy shit. <laughs> Do you remember gathering on the roof? Yeah, it was that night we met each other. You know, we all gathered on the roof and uh, one by one took turns repelling off the side of the parking garage. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, two days later we did it again and car broke her leg. Yeah, you know, I'll, I'll be I'll be the first to to say we did a lot of stupid shit. <laughs> those are those are the memories though, you know? Uh, I think of the lofts. I think of the lofts whenever I think of T-Town and the lofts was our playground, you know. That's where we formed our our friendships and those are going to be some long-lasting friendships. Is that this for your YouTube channel? Yeah, um I do a bunch of stuff like this. I kind of opened in April of 2010. Uh, we sustain pretty well. There's, you know, a bigger community here than a lot of people think. Yeah. So I think it's worked out pretty well for us. Okay, and it's good that you mentioned the bigger community than people think because I think the majority of the student population here in Tuscaloosa doesn't realize how big the gay community is here. Right. And uh, there's a lot of guys who, who aren't out and there's, um, there's, a, there's a good bit who are. So I remember when I first came here, uh, this was probably December or January of 2015. Uh, I wasn't I wasn't out at that time, so I, I was just really nervous coming here. And uh, I don't know, I don't know. It was an awkward situation, but like once I did, it was fine. Um, so of the of the few closeted dudes that do come here, do you think there's a there's a negative opinion about them when they show up? Like, are are they easy to spot or? No, I don't think there's a negative opinion, but everyone here is kind of accepting and friendly, and yeah. um, I generally think they're probably just trying to see who they are, because a lot of people know everyone here. Yeah. You ready? You ready? You ready to go bye bye You ready to go to the car? Well, as y'all can see, my room is empty, and there's a reason for that. I've been packing you up because I am moving, and not just moving into a new house, I am moving away from Alabama. In life, to get what you want, you gotta take risks. The risks may be big, they may be small, they may pay off, they may not. So I'm gonna take a big risk, and I am leaving Alabama. There's a lot of things that I wanna do, and there's some projects that I really wanna work on, and this may be my only window of opportunity to do that. and to get those things done or try to get those things done. You know, I don't know everything and I'm not leaving knowing everything. You're always gonna learn your entire life. But, but I've grown a lot being here and I feel like I've come to the point where I can't really grow here anymore and I need to move on in order to grow further. All right, y'all, this is it. Last time we're gonna be here, moving on. We came, we conquered, <laughs> and it was wild.